I got home from youth group at like 10 p.m. And it is Wednesday night munchies long form video edition. I got this red velvet protein uh, pop tart thing at uh, a GNC at my mall. And um, I'm going to be trying it because I don't normally get stuff like this. I um, like I'm not like a protein bar kind of person. Um, just because, um, but I had seen the Pop-Tarts and some people t say they taste good, some people say they taste like cardboard, and I wanted to put that to the test. Anyways, I like Red Velvet. <laughs> it says here to remove it from the wrapper and microwave 10 seconds and prepare for mind equals blown. Okay, um, guess let's jump in then. We've got our pop tart pastry and down the middle. Oh, that's it's pretty red. It's very different from what it says in the wrapper. The wrapper is a lot darker. It's a bit skinnier. It's it's a little soft. It um feels kind of like I don't know a sunburned forty year old man, like specifically bald too. Wrapper to real thing comparison. They managed to sell it. What can I say? Let's get to microwaving! It's 10, so I actually got home a bit earlier than 10. Beep. Boop. Kinda warm. Not like burn the roof of your mouth warm, but pleasantly warm, okay. I have a knife here. I'm gonna get a fork and take it to the table. Oh, let's get a fun tiny fork. And now we make haste. That's a fun noise. Okay, so the icing looks a bit like cake. And the cake looks a bit also like cake. It is still very firm. I may need to microwave it again. Good cut. Quick. Hmm. Put it on the microwave for about like, you know, 20 seconds. This side of the icing melted, but that part didn't, which concerns me a little bit. Ooh, now it's soft. That's good. Try and get the other end. That's really good, actually. Yeah, the people who say this stuff tastes like cardboard probably just ate it straight out of the bag without warming it up first, because this is amazing. Um, they kind of nailed it with the red velvet chocolates there. The um, it tastes it has that tiny little bit of a espresso undertone, just a little bit. Um. Mostly, it just tastes like red. It's pretty similar to a real pop tart. There's one more protein, 20 grams. It's 180 calories. It's a great sweet treat. So, I'm enjoying this. Those sprinkles are like pure erythritol. Okay. The icing kind of soaks into the cookie, cake, pastry. You can really taste those sugar alcohols. Ugh, I feel so cringy doing it as well. Hopefully that wasn't the last of my icing though. I think it may have been. Nope, still in there. I'm gonna have to try other flavors of this. Burn my tongue a little bit. On a scale out of like 10, give us like a 7.5. Um, I need to get like a context from the other ones to really make a scale rating. So um, I guess that'll have to happen. I like $2 each, it's fine. They just need a bit more frosting. The frosting to cake ratio is a little off. And it's starting to fall apart, so I'm gonna go back to using my knife. 
eine Spornhappe an. Reverse photography is funny chemical. It's like, you know like in some video games when you like go up to something and it like, you interact with it and then it just disappears like after a couple seconds. That's what erythritol is like. It's like sugar that does that and it leaves out like a funny feeling in your mouth. Well, that was really good. If you made this far in the video, please drop a like or a comment or a sub or something. I'm trying to get to 100, guys, and thank you for watching. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. Maybe I'll make more long-form videos, but, you know, nobody ever watches them because I basically only get views from using viral audios and stuff, so who knows. I will see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye.